What up everybody, it's your boy, this is my sneakerhead in the house coming with a brand new unboxing. Before we get started today, please hit that thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share, hit the notification bell on the front of my YouTube channel page so you know when all my vids drop. I'll be doing about four videos today, three to four videos, so if you see me in the same getup, that's why. Let's get right into it though. Alright, the first unboxing is a Nike unboxing. Kind of weird, I guess they had to label this and I took my name off quite a bit this time for it to get to my crib, but um, kind of excited about these. Um, they're still available, um, but I did get them for slightly under retail to see the seat. Now before I show this shoe, I will do a comparison with another shoe paying homage to the same individual. And you guys let me know down below which pair you actually like better. Yeah, I know what this is. Ooh, this is my first pickup of this signature shoe this year. So I haven't picked up any from this line this year because, I mean, they weren't bad, but it was nothing great. But these, Fire Flame Fuego. We have the Kobe 11 Bruce Lee's. Woo, so again, Bruce Lee uh, had a couple, I'm sorry, Kobe uh, line had a couple different Bruce Lee homages that were made. I believe it was the Kobe 5's that was the first and that one is a really hot, hot shoe. And it's you know pretty high on the reseller market as well. But this one I think they executed perfectly as well. Um, they did have a Kobe 10 high, which wasn't a Bruce Lee per se colorway, but it had the yellow and black and it was very similar, but I wasn't feeling those. But these joints here, are sick let me give you a full 360 view of the shoe ah fire love the little hits of red of course you have that drop in zoom um, now the kobe models come with just the heel zoom but if you nike id and then you pay the extra 20 dollars, you can get a full length zoom throughout um, i have i probably won't do a nike id on these but these are sick now i'm gonna show you the shoe i want you to compare them to let me know what you guys think, which one you like better, and why down below so we can chop it up. This shoe here was an Asics, aka Onitsuka Taika collab with Bait, my favorite sneaker boutique apparently since I always win their raffles. But uh, these were proceeds of this did go to the Bruce Lee Foundation, and these are the Onitsuka Tigers right here, the Bruce Lees. These ones I feel are dope, and you have the Bruce Lee uh, logo there. So yeah, I can see it. Bruce Lee logo there. Very sick. Love the marbled uh, midsole. And then it's an all suede upper with the A6 logo being leather. And the inner of the shoe is also leather. And um, But these are super dope. It has a signature inscribed on them. I have worn them a couple times. But these are really, really sick. Um, and then it has his uh, dragon logo on the other pair. So between the two, let me know down below which ones you like better? Do you like the Onitsuka, uh, Tiger and Bay collab Bruce Lee's that came out this year? Or do you like the Kobe 11 Bruce Lee's that just dropped? All right, so let me know down below. Anyway, thanks for tuning in y'all. More videos are on the way. And with that being said, it's your boy, the Smart Sneakerhead, and the brother is out. Peace.